We were knee deep in a beautiful stream in Montana, and I had a feeling this would be a great day. Fish! Oh. <laughs> or stick in the head. <laughs> so in a, in a tight little stream like this with lots of brush, you want to do a lot of roll casting. Just pick your rod up, flip it forward, do a roll cast. Oh, that's, that's, a, fish. that's, a, that's bigger a big fish. fish. That's a, a big bigger fish. fish, Steve. Gosh, do not, do not <sighs> go out in this river. That's wow. a beauty. Can you see them flashing out there? Yes, indeed. Wow, that's a big fish. Yeah, that's a big fish. Oh, man. Boy, I was really surprised to catch such a nice cutthroat in here. That, that is, is a fish. fish. Oh my that is goodness. a mongo fish. Wow. Boy, that's a nice cutthroat. Wow, this water's chilly too. Awesome. Man, just would not expect it, you know? It's a small mountain stream here in Montana. 16, 17 inch cutthroat. That's yes. A great fish, Steve. Wow. Incredible. Incredible. Yeah. Good job. Fun fight, too. Nice. It's good fighting fish. Awesome. It was early April, and the ice had not completely left the river. Watch. It's a stare down. Nothing beats Montana. Yep. What do you think, Steve? Yeah, I think so. I mean, it's not a deep hole or anything, but it looks like it slows down enough for fish to hold. Definitely yeah. deep yeah. enough. Yeah, looks like a couple, three feet deep. Mm -hmm. And this river might be pretty good. Yeah, I thought there'd be something in this lower end, but it's a nice drift. Fish, good All one. Right. Nice. Really nice one, Steve. All right. Oh yeah, good yeah, job. another nice cutthroat. Net. Yeah, that's a nice kind. Yeah, it is. Yeah, right behind this rock, right out there where yeah. it's boiling, kind of just like where he said. So that's awesome. Perfect. Boy, look at that stripe on yeah. there. Yeah, beautiful cutthroat. Took the red sand one worm. Yeah, it did. Nice. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Gorgeous cutty. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, again, on this inside band, you know, these inside bands are a great place for a uh, cutthroat to just relax and catch food. And they don't have to work too hard against the current. Yep. So that's kind of what we're targeting in that in holes. Hey, we're kind of using our standard setup here, a nine foot five weight fly rod. We've got our strike indicator, a couple feet down to a weight. And then it'll about a foot down, we've got our first fly, which is a stone fly, nymph. And then our second fly, which is a San Juan worm. When he first pulled up this little stream, it looked like it was a little high, a little colored. Probably thought we wouldn't catch much fish. But man, we're turning out to be wrong on that. Wow, Steve, this looks like a nice hole down there. Yeah, it does. Um, why don't I fish this out? What do you think if you head down there and fish that little spot? That looks sure. Pretty good. That looks good around the next corner. Sure. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Fish. Oh boy, fish. All right. <laughs> oh man, working my way down this bank here. Huh? It's a bow, huh? No, it's a cut. Oh, it is, huh? I managed to work the cut closer to Steve. Ready? All right. Okay, good job, Got Steve. Got him, thank you. Man, that's a nice cutthroat. Something. There he goes. When you're casting way upstream like this, you want to strip your line back in so that if you do get a strike, you're ready to hook the fish and have put pressure on it. Oh, and there's the fish. Oh, yeah. All right. Another cutthroat. All right. Yeah, that's cool. You want me to grab the net, Steve? Yeah, I think I'm going to, I don't have one with me, so that okay. would be great. I scrambled up the bank and grabbed the net. Oh, 
I'll try and get them close to you, lad, and get to the net here. All right, here he comes. Okay. Look at that fish out there. Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> what, this one is spectacularly colored. Oh, cool. Yeah, it looked like guy. it was pretty bright. Wow, Beautiful yeah, look colored. at the colors. Oh man, this looks like an awesome hole, Steve. Yeah, it does. I really like that soft water over there. Okay. What do yeah, you think? Yeah, I think it looks the best for sure. You're up, so take that. Okay. And uh, I'll just try and hit this inside seam over here and see if there's anything in it. Sounds great. Flows down very nicely right in there. Very nice drift. Fish. And it's a good one. Awesome. Try not to wipe out here. Boy, it sure looked like a cloudy spot. Sure enough, it was. Awesome. Yeah, another nice cutty. But uh, there's also, these are all They're nice They're nice sized fish. Beautiful. Beautifully colored. Awesome. Yeah. We admired the beautiful cut, then I sent it on its way. What a gorgeous. Yeah, nice fish. Yeah. Nice fish. All right, I'm sure liking the stream. Every place you think there's going to be a cutthroat, there is a cutthroat. Yeah, so that's far. nice. I don't want to heck things, but that is very <laughs> nice. Nice to have happen. came down fast and right around that stump it just slowed you could see the current slow down and boom very cool it's oh, nice yeah, to have that's help. a good way it's nice to have help yeah. netting these things i tell yeah. you it's a lot easier steve removed the fly from the trout and put it back into the icy river wow that is so awesome so awesome. Beautiful fish. Cutthroats. Gotta love cutthroats. And like, like Ladin said, just where you expect to catch fish, you were catching them. So cool. And a beautiful place. When you're fly fishing, it's a good idea to debarb your hooks for a couple reasons. One, it's a lot easier on the fish. And two, if you ever see me fish, it's a lot easier on the angler if you get a fly caught in your body. So there's two good reasons for debarbing hooks. Oh yeah, this looks like a good hole. Yeah. Awesome. What do you think here? It's got, you know, nice fast water. Looks like it slows down and deepens up a little bit. Yeah, oh yeah, I think it's prime. Prime cutthroat water. Wow, that should have been a fish. fish. Nice. <laughs> That's a nice one. Yeah, it looks pretty good. <laughs> it's a good cut. Look at that. He took the stonefly nymph. All right. Yeah. Okay, let's try that one again. Okay, yeah. That's the first awesome. one we've had to take the stonefly. We're running two flies. We're running a stonefly. Uh, Pat's rubber legs, brown. And then uh, we also run the San Juan nymph. They're some of the prettiest fish. Look at that beautiful cut. We continue to work our way downstream. I'm trying to hit that seam up there. It goes right along that ice bank. And then it's going to come down the seam. 
There should be a fish there. Oh, there's one, finally. Been riding that seam out there a couple times and I knew there had to be a fish there. And it took a while, but I finally got it. It looks like it's on the pats. Um, I think, Steve, I could jump off this log right down there and if you swing around, I have a net. Oh, okay. Around here. Okay. It's a brown. Yeah, it is. Very cool. You ready? Yeah. Yeah, that All is right. a brown. <laughs> look at that. Oh, look at the colors. Wow, look at the spots on yeah, that Yeah, boy, what a beautiful, beautiful brown trout. Yeah. Brown. <laughs> there she goes. Wow, that's cool. <laughs> yeah, it is. Mountain goats. <laughs> As the evening approached, we found some new water downstream. Oh! Oh, yeah! Yeah. Very nice. Hasty <laughs> <laughs> guy. Boy, he's just hunkered down in there. Mm -hmm. oh, it's pretty awesome. Do you have a net, lad? Uh, yeah, I'll go get it. Okay. It's one Thanks. handy. Boy, he's even taking out a little line. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice. Gosh, they're nice just cut. beautiful fish. Yeah, they are. Mm. Mm, nice cutthroat the colors on that thing. Man, there he goes. Yeah, the cutthroat is such a beautiful fish. Yeah, you know, it is. just love the colors on it and the nice orange stripe on the bottom. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Good job. Cool, thanks. Wow, that looks really good right there. Yeah. Oh, nice current, but it looks deep, slows down on the sides. Yeah, I know. I totally agree. Let's, let's definitely try that. You want me to head up here? Sure, first? I'll try it right here. Okay. Yeah, this is some great water. Steve and I just talked about it. Thought uh, it looks really good. Now there's a bunch of sticks right in here I need to avoid, but if I get out in that heavy current, um, there should be some fish there. It's going to cast and there's a fish on the end of my awesome. line. Yeah, that's a good one. Awesome. Oh yeah, that's a big fish. Look at that, it's a good fat cut. Yes, it is. Steve, I, kn I know you, I made you get your own net last time, <laughs> but I'm begging you to toss me a net. <laughs> Do you want me to net it for you? Yeah, that'd be even better. Sure, that's Dang. a nice fish. In fact, he's getting ready. Oh, yeah, that's a nice fish. Oh, boy. Yes. Nice. Wow, yes. that's a nice cut. Nice cut. Wow, awesome, look at the Steve. orange Thank on that you. thing. You're welcome. Wow. Gosh, that's a gorgeous cut. Oh, boy, yeah. It's a big, beautiful cut. Mm hmm. And upside down. Right out in that fast water. And it is a beautiful colored cut. That's a beautiful colored cutthroat. Oh yeah, boy, I'm telling you. This is a great stream in Montana here. And uh, we were up river a while ago. We decided to come down river. And I'm telling you, it's lights out. It's fantastic. It is. Incredible cutthroat fishing. Yeah, it is. That's awesome. When you're fly fishing, folks, it always really pays off to watch your back casts. Because if not, you catch everything but the fish. Just a heads up on that. Wow, it's a mess.
All right, this looks like a good spot. Oh, oh there's a nice one. Oh, yeah. Good so, fish. That's a nice one. Okay. Yeah, it's a back. nice one. Wow. Nice. Dude. Yep. Thanks. Grab the net. Kind of oh, yeah. Okay, very nice. Bring them over to you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good cut. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> Wow. Yeah. Look at that fish. <laughs> Man, it's just, it's unbelievable. This is just <laughs> incredible fishing. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's awesome. Yeah, you just don't, well, it's hard to find a place like this. But we're going to keep it secret, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Somewhere in Montana. Somewhere in Montana. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Sweet. Oh, there's one. Oh, oh. yeah. Oh, that's, that's a, a nice big fish. One. Yeah, it Another is. Another big one. Unbelievable. Mm-hmm. I would agree. I don't think this guy's close to being done, so I'm not going to try anything crazy. Okay, he's settled down a little bit here. Boy, it's a good one. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's a nice fish. It's got some got some weight to it. Oh man! Oh, we always net a fish head first. Like that. <laughs> there you go. That's how you. I tried it twice by the tail. That didn't work. <laughs> tried it by the head. Worked fantastic. So that's a good tip for you at home. That's and, uh, a good tip. Wow, it's a nice cut. Holy schmoly, that's a good tip. <laughs> oh, baby. That's bigger than I thought it was. <laughs> that's worth something. Ow. That's worth something. Man, that's a good. That's a nice yeah. cutthroat. Yeah, the barbless mm. flies are out. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Oops. Man, that's a big fish. Wow. Nice. Uh, right. well. Steve pulled the large cutthroat from the net. Right. That is a nice cutthroat. Mm. Beautiful. Wow, I don't know how big that is, but it's the biggest one of the day, I think. Yeah. For sure. Yeah, so. you've had a couple in that range, though. That one up high. Yeah, it might have been. That could might have been. But still, man, just beautiful mm -hmm. fish. Yeah. Awesome. Yes. Yeah. Well, folks, I sure hope you enjoyed this day as much as we did. We had some great fishing, a lot of fun, small stream Montana. What do you think? Steve? Yeah, loved it. Just yeah. a lot of fun. All right. Well, be sure to join us next week for more Fishing with Ladin. Be sure to join us next time for more Fishing with Ladin. Because we're having fun catching fish. Be sure to join us next time for more Fishing with Lad. Because we're having fun catching fish. Hey folks, please subscribe to our YouTube channel.